hello friends in this video i will explain how you can uh, perform the experiment of and get or get and not get by using transistor it means uh, this basic logic gates by using transistor how you can design the circuit okay as I already shown in the beginning the circuit diagram of all these three basic gates okay accordingly i am going to design the circuit so for performing this experiment two 10 kilo ohm resistor to 2n double two double two type transistor one 4.7 kilo ohm resistor is required okay and for seeing output now this is a digital trainer kit which i am going to use for seeing the out for checking the output i will use uh, these leds okay for giving inputs i will use uh, these terminals these terminals are used to, for giving input whether input it is a plus 5 volt or ground okay so first of all as already shown in the beginning the pin uh, configuration of uh, transistors 2n2222 <coughs> and going to use two transistors first i will explain about and gate then after or gate and then not gate so for performing the experiment of uh, AND gate, two transistors are required. So here two transistors have taken. So now you have to mount this transistor on uh, this uh, breadboard like this. Okay, like this means this is this part. It is uh, you know what uh, plane. Okay, the face which is plane that you have to keep towards you. So now here connected now mount here second transistor so this is the second transistor transistor mounted then after <coughs> two 10 kilo ohm resistor and first thing you have to see which one is emitter which one is base and which one is collector so according to the pin configuration mean of this transistor so the left side okay uh, if you uh, face uh, this transistor the plane face of this transistor where some numberings are there towards you then the left terminal it will be emitter the middle one it is the base and the right side uh, terminal it is the collector okay so 10 kilo ohm resistor should be connected to the basis of these two transistor so now you can see here two 10 kilo ohm resistors uh, i am taking here so i am connecting to the basis of these two transistor connected after that two inputs means two inputs we have to give so i am going to give inputs through these two wires these two gray wires so input should be given to this to 10 kilo ohm resistor so connected to these two 10 kilo ohm resistors okay then after emitter of the first is connected to the collector of the second okay so emitter of the first so emitter of the first meaning the left side terminal so the left uh, terminal of the first transistor is connected to the right terminal of the second transistor so emitter of the first connected to the collector of the second then after emitter of the second is connected to 4.7 kilo ohm resistor so here you can see this is 4.7 kilo ohm uh, resistor which i am uh, taking so this uh, resistor we have to connect uh, to the emitter of the second transistor so emitter of the second transistor connected here now connected okay so inserted here emitter of the second transistor here mounted and then after now the other terminal of the 7 4.7 kilo on the resistor we have to connect to the ground so this black wire i'm using for connecting this to ground so connected to ground okay and after that we have to connect the collector of the first transistor to plus 5 volt <clears throat> so for connecting to plus 5 volt i'm going to use this yellow wire now you can see here this is plus 5 volt here coming by red wire 
connect here this 2 plus 2 uh, where we have to connect to the collector so collector of the first transistor it means the right terminal the right terminal of this first transistor I am connecting okay connected then circuit uh, here it is over now one more thing which we have to take the output output we have to take from the emitter of the second transistor so this is the emitter of the second transistor so we can take from here emitter of the second transistor okay this is the left uh, terminal of the transistor from there I am taking the output and output is connected to this LED okay in this way circuit is over now we have to see the whether it is working or not first of all turn on this uh, okay now when both zero zero output is zero this is and gate and gate when the zero one output is zero when one zero when one zero output is zero when both one one now you can see output is one it means this is working as and gate clear in the same way we can uh, design uh, or get also okay again same what are the things first of all remove first of all turn off this and then remove uh, these wires remove these wires okay removed so I left only these two transistors connected okay these two transistors and uh, four point sorry 10 kilo ohm resistors are connected to the basis of these two transistors okay and uh, 10 kilo ohm resistors are a and b are connected to input a and b so i am connecting these two gray wires that these are a and b okay then after you can see the collector of both these two transistors are common we connected with each other and both are connected to plus 5 volt so for that collector of these two transistors so collector of the first trans second uh, first first and second transistors I am connecting now collector of uh, the first and the second transistor connected with each other okay and then after that is going to connect to plus 5 volt for that uh, plus 5 volt I am going to use uh, this yellow wire to connect to this uh, terminal now connected to plus 5 volt okay plus 5 volt given to the collector of both uh, transistors after that we have to connect the emitter of both transistors okay emitter of both transistor so for connecting the emitter of these two transistors <coughs> okay i am going to use uh, other means this blue color wire emitter of these two transistors we have to connect so the left terminal of the first transistor and the left terminal of the second transistor okay connected means made common so left terminal of the first and left terminal of the second transistor connected with each other then after uh, this this is from here we have to take output also and before that we have to connect one 4.7 kilo ohm resistor so 4.7 kilo ohm resistor this is so this that i'm going to connect to the emitter emitter of the second transistor connected here and after that after that uh, the other terminal of uh, this um, 4.7 kilo should be connected to the ground so now you see the other terminal of this uh, resistor is connected to the ground connected to this ground now the terminal of this uh, 4.7 kilo ohm resistor according to the circuit diagram and then output we have to take okay output we have to take from the emitter of the second transistor so now you can see this is a red wire which i'm going to use to take the output so emitter of the first transistor second transistor so the left terminal we have to connect to the left terminal of this transistor that is the emitter so connected here and then circuit is over so now we have to check whether it is working as or gate or not so now you can verify the truth table first of all turn on this so first of all both zero zero now you can see both inputs here given now you gray wires are using i'm using to give input so when inputs are zero zero both leds are not glowing 
so output is zero our led is not glowing when zero one when zero one output is one because output is glowing led when one zero then again output is one it means led is glowing and when one one then again output is glowing it means this uh, or get two table verified by using this circuit diagram so it, it means uh, we have designed uh, or get by using transistors okay in the same way we can design not get also okay i will show you so first of all uh, turn off <coughs> remove these uh, wires I removed so for performing the experiment of uh, or get we use only sorry for not get uh, we have to use only one transistor so according to that circuit diagram <coughs> base of uh, this transistor should be connected to 10 kilo ohm resistor and then one so now you can see this gray wire is using to give uh, as input so connected to input terminal and then <coughs> 4.7 okay 4 point 4.7 kilo 4.7 kilo 4.7 kilo ohm register is connected to the collector of this transistor so this 4 point uh, <coughs> this is 4.7 kilo ohm resistor we have to connect to the collector of this transistor so connected to the collector of the <coughs> this transistor okay and then after the other terminal of this 4.7 kilo ohm resistor should be connected to plus 5 volt so this is uh, this is the other terminal of this uh, resistor 4.7 kilo ohm resistor so that uh, we have to connect to a uh, plus 5 volt so plus connected to plus 5 volt connected okay and now a meter emitter of this uh, transistor we have to connect to ground so <clears throat> the left terminal of this transistor is ground okay we have to connect to the ground left terminal of this transistor is emitter and that we have to connect to ground so here left terminal of this transistor is connected to the ground clear so it means circuit it is over and output we have to take from the collector so for uh, taking output i'm using this uh, red wire so from collector so the right terminal of this transistor is uh, collector so there we have to insert and then we can see the output okay so first of all so this uh, left left to uh, our terminal is used to give input first uh, you <coughs> turn on okay when we turn on so now you can see when input is zero as uh, since led is not going it means input is zero then output here you can see it is one okay and when here when input now you can see here when input i give one then output is zero so it means we are getting just a positive if input is one then output uh, zero so input one means means input giving five volt then output is zero volt and when input giving zero volt then output we are getting five volt okay in this way we can perform the experiment of uh, basic uh, logic and or and not by using transistor okay thank you